I'm Kat and I hate horror movies. And today we're watching Pet Cemetery. Another Stephen King. Because why stop now? I don't know anything about this movie other than the fact that it was based on a Stephen King novel and that's all I know. There will be pets and probably nothing good becomes of them. Spoilers in the name. Let's get into it. I'm sure everything will be fine. Just creepy kids humming creepy music. A super start. No one's visited this graveyard for quite a while. Probably haven't hugged my doctor today. Finally here. Ah. Yeah. Oh, that's a cute kid. What do you think? Objectively impressive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Decided to wake up and see what home looks like, huh? Ah. These kids aren't creepy at all. We like that. I spoke too soon. Mommy! Daddy! Ah! <laughs> He's a cute kid. That kid looks familiar, kind of. He's got a familiar looking face. Have I seen this kid in something? Cut. Better not. Surely. Oh. Come on! You won't watch out that road. Them damn trucks go back and forth all day and most of the night. Your dad's gonna be the new doctor up the college, I hear. Mr. Crandall, yeah. there's a path over there. Do you know where it goes? Ah, oh, the old pet cemetery. <laughs> I'll take you up there sometime. Tell you the story, too. After you get settled in. Great. Things are off to a great start. That you, Doc? Yeah, it's me. Well, come on up and have a beer. Ah, oh, that's fun. Need a glass? Not at all. Good for you. Are you a wussy? Is what he asked. You know that path your wife commented on? Well, where does it lead? Pet cemetery. Huh. There's that damn road. Uses up a lot of animals. Dogs and cats, mostly. My little girl's got a cat. Winston Churchill. Call him Church for short. Cute. I get him fixed by you. Fixed cat don't tend to wander. It's all the time crossing back and forth on that road, his luck will run out. Meantime, Doc, here's your bones. Here's your bones. I love that toast. Ugh. I'm taking that. That's the cutest cat. Look at that cat. God, that's a cute cat. Yeah! <laughs> What's it say, Mommy? It says Pet Cemetery, honey. It's misspelled, but that's what it says. A graveyard for pets killed in the road. Built by broken-hearted children. Well, they have to learn about death somehow, now don't they, Ms. Creed? Why? You're strangely defensive about that. That's where I buried my dog Spot. When he died of old age, 1924. Aww. Do you know what a graveyard really is? It's a place of rest. Hmm. And speaking. Can you remember that? That's a nice way to think of it. Nothing wrong with that. Something's in the bush. What if Church dies and has to go to the pet cemetery? Church might still be alive when you're in high school. Ah, uh, that's a very cute cat. We'll all be upset if something happens to that cat. I got a bad feeling. I don't want Church to get his nuts cut, Daddy. Where did you hear that? Is he dead, Church? Church will be all right, honey. You promise, Daddy? Don't shilly-shally, Lewis. Give the little girl a promise. You need to unpack that. Church will be fine. I promise. Mm -mm. 
She's got to un unpack her death trauma. If anything does happen while he's under the gas, you explain it to mm -hmm. him. <laughs> this kid, all right. It's wasteful. Gotta go. Love you, bye. No? Ah, a little unspoken tension under the surface. Going to get his nuts cut, yeah. Thank you, Missy, for introducing that colorful phrase into my daughter's vocabulary. Don't mention it. Talk to him about your stomach. How's that bellyache of yours? It'll pass. They always do. Still friends, Doc? There's the goodbye, Smoochie. Ooh. Have a great first day at school, Doc. You just kid. Huh? His guts, his brain. Oh, uh, you get to see everything. This is a zombie flick? Sleeping soundly after that, I see. Not likely. Come on, Doc. We've got places to go. He's hallucinating. Wake your wife. Tell her what you saw. Ah, he'll go. He'll just go. Yeah. Come on, Doc. <gasps> Don't make me tell you twice. This is, this is, this is, this is. Wow, okay. Go, go, go. What's he gonna do? Hey, why are you here? I want to help you because, Louis, because you tried to help me. Great. Creepy basement. <laughs> Why the jump scares always? God, for someone on a mission, he's really moving at the speed of snail. I have to show you something, but it's not urgent. Take your time. <sighs> he's gonna jump scare me again, isn't he? This is the place where the dead speak. I want to wake up. That's all. Don't go on, Doc. No matter how much you may feel you have to. I just want to wake up. That's all. The ground beyond is solid. He's gonna get excited. He's gonna think it was all a dream. You up, Doc? Getting there. <laughs> nah, yeah, don't tell your wife. Just keep that to yourself. I don't like to think of you rattling around the house on Thanksgiving Day. You're going with the kids and without me. Great. As far as your dad is concerned, I'm never going to be a member of the family. What's there not to approve of? Handsome doctor? Lewis, there's a dead cat over here on the edge of my lawn. I think it might be your daughter's. <sighs> Yikes. Oh boy. Doesn't look like him. Yep. Oh, it is. Damn. Ooh, yeah. What are you gonna do with it? Put him in the garage, I guess. 
I'll bury him in the morning. You gonna tell Ali? Just tell her I haven't seen the damn cat around, you know? I don't want to spoil her holiday. Maybe there's a better way. You take him to the pet cemetery, to the place where not they speak, but the place where they walk. The place we're going is on the other side of that. No, we can't climb over that. We'll break our necks. No, we won't. I've climbed a time or two before. I know all the places to step. You're a haunted man. He's evil. Don't look down. Don't stop. Imagine? Imagine. Father now. This man better not be evil. I trusted him moments ago. Jay. He knows something. Just a loon. That's all. <laughs> yeah, it sounded like a loon. Man's never heard a loon in his life. Hey, where are we going? <clears throat> Said no one. This was their burial ground. Whose burial ground? Big Mac Indians. I brought you here to bury Ellen's cat. I'd help you, but you gotta do it yourself. Doesn't ask any questions? No follow-up? I'd help, but I want to survive. <laughs> Is the cat gonna come back to life? He's gonna have a terrible nightmare tonight. Lewis? When you talk to him, not one word about what we done tonight. What did we do tonight, Judd? What have you done to him? Mean? What has he done? We'll find out. Hi, Daddy. Hi, baby. I, I guess he's just fine, Ellie. I haven't seen him this evening. And kiss him goodnight for me. Yuck. Kiss your own cat. Yuck. <laughs> kiss your own cat. <laughs> Hi, Daddy. I love you. Oh, God, they picked a cute kid. Oof. Hi, Daddy. I love you. Say you love him. <sighs> That's the horror of this movie. That kid heard nothing on the other end. Gives up, moves a few leaves around, and then gives up. Oh, classic. No, 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 no. Jeez. Well, don't let him run back out into the road. How did he swim his way out of the, the dirt? Hold on a second. That's a cute cat. God, he chewed his way out. Jesus, boy, Christ. Oh, clean that. I tried to tell myself that I buried him alive. Well, I feel like I'm going crazy. It was the rag man who told me about the place. He was half Mac himself. Spotted got caught in Bob wire that infected. Oh. Ragman did for me what I did for you last night. John, come and get your dog! They come back evil. The animals come back evil. Spot came back all right. Spot! It was never quite the same dog that I know. Has anyone ever buried a person up there? Christ on his throne, no. And whoever would? You? I don't believe you. Far as I can throw you. He was buried there. Or something. He... He and his... He and... He, he was buried there. This is gonna be bad. Yeah.
That's a death cut. Clean it. Water's a bit yellow. Yeah, get right in there with the dirty water. Or cover your face with a attack. <laughs> Please, why? Oh! But it's a gift. No, that, that's a gift. It's okay. How the hell did you get in here? Oh, don't, oh! don't do that. Oh my god. It's a gift. Don't cats give gifts when they like you? Don't worry. I'm not worried. Daddy! Hi, sugar. Ah, uh, he shows up with flowers. That's so cute. That's cute. Daddy, is church all right? Yes. I had a dream about him. I dreamed he got hit by a car. And you and Mr. Crandall buried him in the pet cemetery. Is he really all That's right? That's exactly what happened. Yes. Church smells bad. Church is dead. Someone should tell her. I am sure I have cancer. I cannot fake the pain. Take the pain. Sorry. Oh no. Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, no! Let the doctor see you, it might- No, please, no, please. And now, may the Lord bless you and keep you, and lift you up, and give you peace. You can't just say, I think I have cancer. Get a doctor's opinion. Rachel not feeling well? Well, just a touch of the flu. He's been throwing up ever since Mrs. Rogers called and said Mrs. That's Dandridge. enough. How's your cat, Lois? Jelly's cat. It's your cat now. Because she brought you the, the rat as the gift. You're the owner now. And scientists don't know why. The eyes are a bit much. Is Missy in heaven? Do you think? Some believe in heaven or hell. I think we go on. I have faith in that. You believe in it. That's nice. That's optimistic. Because energy can't be created or destroyed. It can only change form, right? Any scientists in the, in the, in the, out there? I heard you in Ellie tonight. I know you don't approve of the subject. I just get scared. My sister, Zelda. I know, she died. Spinal meningitis. She was in the back bedroom like a dirty secret. My sister died in the back bedroom, and that's what she was. A dirty <laughs> secret. Oof. I had to feed her sometimes. I hated it. Wished for her to be dead. It wasn't just so she wouldn't feel any more pain. It was because she started to look like this monster. Even now, I wake up and I think, is Zelda dead yet? Is she? My parents were gone when she died. Oh. To convulse, and I thought, Oh no, Zelda's choking, and they'll say I murdered her by choking. They'll say you hated her, Rachel, and that was true. Oh, and then she died. And I ran out of the house screaming, Zelda's dead. And the neighbors that came out at the end, they looked. They thought I was crying, <laughs> but you know something? I was laughing. Whoa. Wow. Okay. The childhood trauma is taking shape. We see it now. Whew. You should have never been left alone with her, Rachel. Never. Where are you going? I'm going to get you a Valium. But you know I don't take. Tonight you do. 
You know I don't take Valium. Tonight, you're taking Valium. All right. Someone in this movie's gonna die and they're gonna be buried in the cemetery and then they're gonna come back to life, right? Right? Mommy, look! Watch him. There it goes! Higher! Higher! We want it higher! That day, oh, oh. Here you go, buddy. Takes him, he flies away. Don't love these jump cuts. You got it. Gage is flying. It's the cutest kid ever. Ever. I'm flying. The music slightly turns sinister. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. In just a minute. Just a minute. <sighs> not. Don't let him go. Not good. Go, go, go. Get him, Louis. Get him, Louis. You silly Get man. Get that baby! Why would you just honk and not slow down? Very sad to have called that one. They'll bring him back. We won't miss him for long. They'll bring him back. And I'm sure it'll go well. I knew something like this would happen. I told her when you were first married, you'll have all the grief you can stand. Oh, shut up. I hope you're right Go hell. to actually Where go to hell. Punch him. You kill her, No, the other way. Punch the other guy. Ugh. Wow, how crappy of a dude do you have to be to say all that to a grieving parent? Wow. Next level. Daddy? God could take it back if he wanted to, couldn't he? Don't give him any ideas. Can I have faith in that? No. Yes. Oh, okay. I suppose you can. This is gonna go so poorly. Also, everyone in the town will be like, what's your son doing walking around? And why does he smell? Don't deny the thought hadn't crossed your mind, Lois. You asked me if anyone had ever buried a person up there. I lied to you when I said no. No. He was killed on his way home. The Second World War. Oof. Father Bill Baderman was grief struck. He buried his son up there before he ever had a chance. Get the bottom of the truth. What's the bottom of the truth? The person you put up there ain't the person that comes back. Whatever lives in the ground beyond the pet cemetery. Ain't human at all. It was Margie. Who finally came to some of us men folks and said it had to be stopped. She knew it was an abomination. Then we got to my car and went over the Baderman place. Take care of it. Wait a minute, fellas. Wait a minute. There's no need to burn the whole house. Surely you could just grab him. Kill him. Not kill Timmy and his whole family. Can't make it up. Truly can't make it up. The stupidity. Lewis, sometimes dad is better. You're telling me that place New Gage was going to die. Because I introduced you to the power. I may have murdered your son, Lewis. <laughs> He doesn't need to take that on. This could be the beginning of patching things up with your folks. I don't want to go to Chicago, Grandma Dory. I had a bad dream last night. About what? About 
Daddy. Engage. And someone named Pax Cat. You guys better get going. That's the guy from the beginning. Her creepy little dreams mean things. What can I say? I lost my mind. We all lost our minds, Erwin. Just the silliest little handshake you've ever seen. Tell your daddy what you saw. Take care of your mother, darling. I'll be there in three days. Everything's gonna be all right, Ellie. Do you swear? I swear. Wow, convincing. It's the dead eyes that do it. Let's go. <sighs> yes, I will. I'll be there as soon as your brother raises from the dead. I mean, the cat seems to be fine, is probably what he's thinking. A little nippy, but mainly fine. You can't dig up a whole grave in the middle of the day. Someone will surely stop you. The barrier was not meant to be crossed. Do the right thing here. If he comes back. And he's like Judd said Timmy Benjamin was. I'll just put him back to sleep. Yeah, I'm sure that'll be easy. Honey, you just had a bad Daddy. dream, that's all. You know that, don't you? Dad guess his dad is gonna do something really bad. Magical child with magical dreams that reveal the truth. Oh, oh my god! Pascal. Pascal? He was trying to help me because Daddy was helping him. Security around around there is lax. Probably went out for a hamburger or a chicken dinner. You know how men are when they're alone. A chicken dinner, men. Smart to call him. Hello? It's Rachel Creed. I'm calling from Chicago. Is Lewis with you? No. Well, if he drops by, I'll, I'll tell him to call you. Don't bother, Judd. I'm coming home. Rachel, no. Rachel? Rachel? Yikes. I swear it's going to be all the doctor's lost the twinkle in his eye, I will say. Oh boy. She said he's a good ghost, so you don't have to be worried if it is Pascal. I wish he would appear to the mother. Oh boy. No! I'm coming for you. Off we go. Arriving a bit early. I'm falling asleep with a cigarette in your hand. That's the real horror of this movie. Very dangerous. Like falling asleep in the bath. But the fire version. I'm sorry. It's been very busy. What about the Aries K? The one with the scratch on its side? I do have an Aries K. Yep, and there's a long scrape up one side. I'll take it. He's a good ghost, and he's also kind of the comedic relief? Interesting to add a little levity in something like this. Very interesting choice. Just imagination. Yes. People are coming back from the, from the dead, and you're queuing that up as imagination? Wow, just like tunnel vision. You've seen crazier. She's gonna make it just in time. This feels like her 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 hero arc. Oh, never mind. 
I spoke too soon. Ah, I hope she bought insurance. It's trying to stop you. Do you hear me? Go. S keep going. Is anyone there? Yeah. Come back to me, Gage. He did a bad thing. Yeah, that's an exhausting day. Already? So soon? That's soon. That's really soon. Hey! Hey, stop! You owe me! <laughs> Hitchhiking, that always goes well. Hey, wasn't that the road up for Camp Crystal Lake back there? <laughs> well, he found his way home. It's impressive, he's quite young. This is just a zombie flick, at its core. What are you doing? What are you doing in his doctor bag? Turns into a tiny murderer? Wow. Knew where all of daddy's instruments were? Huh. Okay. It's here. Careful. Although he could probably only really stab him in the shin. So what's the worst that could happen, right? Cutest kid and turned him creepy. Let's play hide and go seek. Nobody wants to play hide and go seek with you, kid. Not a one person. <laughs> All right. No, no, no. So the kid went to his house. Why would he do that? Gage. Why wouldn't he go to his own house? You the one playing games? No, it's another possessed little boy. Why would he terrorize this sweet man? Doesn't make any sense! <laughs> Try to triangulate where the laugh is coming from. Slow pan. Always a slow pan. <sighs> He's gonna jump on the bed and get you with the scalpel. Gage! No, 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 no. No, 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 no! I brought you something. It's a knife! He's gonna get him from mine! You're not being careful enough. Can you believe this? This is the silliness. He's gonna be under the bed or behind the bed. <laughs> Don't look! Ow! He's gonna get your eye. He's gonna get you in the face. This is not the move. There it is. He's gonna get him in his... He's gonna get him. Where did you go? Oh, oh. Strong, strong little... Possessed little boy! This is a zombie flick. Arr, arr, arr. Oh no! So much flesh! Surely. Uh, no. Surely he could have grabbed him and. Tossed him somewhere. Nah, all right. I'd call that. I'd call this. Uh, I'd call this a bad situation. Thank you so much. Think nothing of it. I'm not allowed any further. I'm sure things will be fine. Why? I'm not. I'm not allowed any further. Oh, we like him. He's our friend, you know. Rachel. Oh good, at least she's wearing shoes she can run in. <gasps> Bunch of zombies. This is a zombie flick. Nobody told me. Judd? He's still alive. Which is good. He's having trouble vocalizing because the kid ate his throat out. Judd? Are you up there? Rachel? 
I'm going to twist your back like mine. Never get out of there no, again. No, no, no. Never get out. <sighs> He's dressed for the show. What's happening? In a dress and a tie. I you something, mommy. Nah. Okay. Nah. No. That is something, mommy. Okay. <laughs> Dead. I brought you something, mommy. Oh my god. Why would you run toward a little boy holding a sharp scalpel? I guess if you think it's your son. Jeez. Gage. Well, you're up one, but you're down two. Don't let him overpower you. Don't get suckered in. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. <gasps> Hello? Hello, Lewis. I just wanted to be sure Rachel got back all right. No. Billy had a dream. Er, I can't talk to you right now. To the basement, huh? Who is it? I can't talk to you right now. Alright, yes, Daddy. Will you come over and play with me? What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> He's gonna do the thing. He's gonna be good. So, the last person who came back to life was just kind of like a mindless zombie, but he's brought back a full serial killer who's making calls. Church. Yum. Cook that up medium rare? Definitely. Don't pick up a cat like that, or can you? I don't know. Poor thing. Oh, come on, not in the... Oh, no, okay, that's fine. Oh. oh. How did they do this to a cat? Oh. Be dead! No, no animals were harmed in the making of this movie, right? Obviously, they didn't kill the cat, but it didn't look pleasant. Gage. Wow. Torture place. Rachel! Oh my goodness, it's all in Gage, you did not. mind. Gage? Hi, Daddy. All right, Gage. Let's play. <laughs> you know he has a scalpel. You got nothing to ward him off? Nah. He wouldn't. He wouldn't? <laughs> Good, good for him looking up and down. You know, you never know where he's gonna be. He might have come back an excellent climber. Okay. All right. He's back to old tactics. Straight to under the bed. I guess it worked last time. Turn around. Look around you. This is a mistake. You're gonna get stabbed. Dead. No, please! <laughs> Damn. He shouldn't be this strong. He's just a baby. He should not be this good. He should not be this strong. Get him, turn him, flip him. We got backups, baby. Come here. No fair. No fair, no 
Is that kid okay? He fell. Go finish the job. Did he go? Did he check a pulse? Did he do the whole thing? He's finishing the job now. There he is. All right, there he goes. There he goes. All right. I believe he's finished the job. Ugh. I'm sorry, Lewis. But don't make it worse. Don't. I waited too long with Gage. It will work this time because she just died. Lewis! What? Don't! Do the right thing, Lewis. I promise. Oh boy. Every time he does this, it comes back twofold with the cat and the kid, and now the kid, and then two more adults. This is gonna be a disaster. It's a disaster. What do you gotta do to teach this guy a lesson, huh? Get your needles and wait facing the door. Dual wield. Are you gonna give her a paper cut? This is a disaster. He's wholly unprepared. Ooh, nails. Oh, God. I guess he wants to die. I guess he's like, if I don't have you, she's gonna kill him with the, her heel or something. No. Oh, 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 so, 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 I guess you would call this a success. <laughs> that was insane. He just kept doing the same thing over and over again. Not a once did he learn from his mistakes. That's a man for you. <laughs> that kid went from adorable to creepy real quick. Did that young little baby actor play his crazy form? Cause it looked like him. That kid was a really good actor. Wow, another great Stephen King. Well, I give Pet Cemetery 10 sweet little boys out of 10 sweet little psychos. Really went full psycho. That kid had range. This is... Thank you so much for watching that with me. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps me a lot and it tells me that you want me to watch more of these. And speaking of more of these, if there's another movie that you want me to watch, leave it in the comments. I will read all of them. I'm gonna go for a walk now. But you should watch another one of my videos because this was fun. Creepy kids. See you soon.